today for the uh, world's oldest derby. Sheffield FC play uh, Hallam FC. It's a football start, and uh, you know, to have that piece of history, you've got Sheffield, obviously, the oldest football club in the world, where you've got Hallam, you've got the oldest football ground in the world. It's really important to remember where the game came from and why the game was developed. Daniel Cresic, William Press, they wanted to winter recreation for the sport of cricket and came up with different rules that had been played around England and universities. I mean, it's the world's first derby and um, I think this is definitely a place where you should be at least once in your lifetime. It's not all about money, it is truly about community and the love of the game. It's about making sure that the game prospers, thrives, flourishes and grows at grassroots level. We're not objecting to the top end of the game. All we're saying is that 99.9% .9 of people love the game at this level and below. The game is for everybody and I think we offer uh, a great standard of football but for the normal Sheffield people. Summer's came. It's really important to preserve and protect the heritage of the world's first football club. You know, we are an old football club, but we're a very progressive football club. It's a great ladies' side, futsal side. You know, we play for the love of the game, to play at the highest level possible without being professional. We have a saying, non-professional since 1857. Football is all about history and resetting history, but you can't take away being the oldest club in the world. And it's very important, it seems like Sheffield and Holland, not finding money and raising money to make sure they survive and, and go on in the future and we, we build support and we make sure that everybody is driving towards the growth of the game at grassroots level. Because if we do that, everyone will be happy and Wilson will be around another 156 years.